I did not see this twist coming. As some rich folks are having a party, all of a sudden it's crashed by a maniac who holds all of them hostage. But then out of nowhere, Robocop still comes through. And as the man is still threatening him by every second, Robocop grabs him and he tosses him right before everything explodes. And for the briefest moment, he lets himself feel the rain and all the memories that happened to him recently. The woman's touch and how he feels so disconnected from everything. But then out of nowhere, he gets blasted with a devastating blow that put him straight down. In total confusion, he asks why. Before he can get an answer, she takes him out for good. And in the future, everything starts falling apart for Skynet. She succeeded, but in their last ditch effort, they created some Terminators and sent them back in the time. They get sent back in the middle of a basketball game, but at this time, it's three of them. And the crowd goes a little crazy, but they manage to get their own disguises and weapons. After removing the guy from the party, he starts to walk back to his car, and he starts to think if he's really disconnected from everything. But then he hears a car swerving. It misses him, but it also saves him at the same time. But the occupants in the car, they end up taking out the woman from earlier. She won't be repeating history like last time, but Robocop still takes aim as it is still a crime. And he starts to analyze and gets closer and closer and notices something is off, a robotic eye. And the woman's still there, barely holding on to her life, threatening him and telling him, get your hands off me. You're the one that ended all of this. You're the reason why the world ends. 